Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 1, Dawn of Souls. Um, last time, we went into the ice caverns and got the levy stone. Today, I'm going to be showing you what the levy stone does, and we're going to be moving on to our next dungeon. Not our next crystal dungeon, mind you. Um, take the levee stone south of Crescent Lake and beat up any random encounters you might find yourself in. And take it to the desert here. Welcome to Rukian Desert. I am pretty sure I said that right. Maybe not. Probably not. The levy stone in the middle of the desert. Moses split the desert like he did the ocean. Whoa. Uh, for the Game Boy, I still believe these are some of the coolest effects I've ever seen in Final Fantasy, considering the time these games were made in. But yes, we now have full and complete access to the airship. Da, 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 da. Our ship has now become useless, and by useless I mean completely useless. The only time we will ever, ever be using it again, actually now that I think about it, will be never. Because <laughs> I think everywhere we, oh nope, we will be using it for one thing. Uh, for one of the extra dungeons we're going to need it. But how do you like that? Free roam! Yeah, see, this is where we're supposed to be heading. Um, I'm not going to go there yet, though. I am first going to stop back at town. And heal the party. Um, off screen, between episodes, I also bought a death for our black mage. Um, and the spell I wanted for the white mage, she can't learn yet. So, I'm going to hang off on buying that for her. Um, the next place we want to go... Is do, 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 way up north. Uh, not here. Uh, where am I? Oh, I gotta land first. Why you can't open them? Oh yeah, and you can't park in swamps. I forgot about that. Uh, you park in deserts. All right, we got this in the desert. I don't see why we can't park in deserts. Um, we can't park in that because that's too shallow. I'm gonna park right here. Um, at this point, you do have access to every town in the game, so you can get what you want to. I want the full map. Um, I want to go to the uh, west a little bit. Yes, but now you have access to almost every town in the game, um, other than the one to the direct south of where I'm flashing right now. Um, that we need something else to get to. Um, so you could go around collecting spells and whatnot. Um, items that would normally be obtained till later. Stuff like that. Uh, oh crap, we're gonna be using our ship again right away because I can't land the airship anywhere around here. Um, so I lied. We will be using the ship here shortly. Um, because this is where we want to go next. After, is it? Oops, no. Land. Um, I'm not sure if this is the one I want to go in or not. Um, nope. There's a series of islands here. Oops, crap. Uh, Hellfire Chasm, we will be coming back to later as well, and why there's an elf in the Fire Chasm, I have no idea. Probably because other races are in the other caverns, and elf was pretty much the last one. Um, was this where I needed to go? 
No, but there's a chest here I'll gladly take. An elixir. 500 gill and a cottage. The cottage and the gill, or er, the cottage and the elixir are pretty good. Gill, not so much. That's another one of the places we'll be coming back to later. Um, was this one it? Tent. I think this is not just another chest area. Dry ether, gold needle. That wasn't one of them either. Okay, uh, there's a castle. Alright, we went to you. Might have been this one. Oh, this one's another item one. Oh, which one of these islands was it? Gill. X potion. Gill, gill. Yeah, like I said, now that you have free roam on the airship, there's a lot of stuff you could do right now. Um. Okay, so it wasn't you. That was one of you two then. It wasn't this one. So hopefully you, because I think you're the last one. E yes, this one's it. I am King. I am the Dragon King Bahamut. I confer my honor upon those strength and courage. Return to me with a token of your courage. Um, we have to talk to him first. Um, I know in other versions that you don't have to talk to him. I think in the original version you didn't have to, and the PSP version you didn't have to. Um, why they made you have to talk to him in this version, I don't know. Anyway, back to the ship in time for a lot of sailing. I go, so how, remember how I said the ship was useless at the beginning of this video? Yeah, I already take it back. Yeah. Uh, where am I at? Okay, I'm not that far from it. So we're gonna park you right there. And of course the only space that I had to walk on, I got an encounter. Alright, uh... So if I just go south and to the right a little, or left a little, I should be good. Kill the Sahagan sharks and big eyes! Um, if you remember the training area, this is the point of the game that you're gonna be getting into fighting everything we were fighting there on a regular basis, plus some stuff. Yeah. The area we're going to is not, by any means, a friendly area. Where am I at? Uh, I gotta go to the left more. Yeah, but this isn't by, f not by any means, a friendly area that we're going to. Um, I don't remember it being as an annoying as the marsh cave, or as troublesome as the ice cavern was for us. So, hopefully... Um, I don't mess up too much. Uh, see these wear tigers? Um, the wear blade will actually do plenty of damage to them. Uh, right now, more than the coral sword would. Um, more than the flame sword? Maybe. I'm not too entirely sure on that one. Um, but I do want to tell you, drop a cottage before going in here. Citadel of Trials, first floor. You came bearing the crown, I see. Um, another thing I find funny about this, um, you cannot enter here without, uh, the crown of the western keep um for some odd reason uh, if you've managed to go out exploring and try coming here before then um you will not be allowed in uh you can and technically enter here right after defeating astos in other versions and a lot of people do do that 
Um, however, you can't do what this, or the thing that this requires, you can't, that requires this, ugh, tongue tied again, um, you can't do for a while, um, like I said, you can't do that until after getting the airship, so, in this version, you have to talk to Bahamut first, um, so I had to wait anyway, otherwise I would have done this sooner. But another version, you can technically do this right after defeating Astos. Very well. I shall grant you the right to undergo the trials. Go on now. Sit upon the throne. Your courage will be put to the test. If true courage dwells within you, you'll find proof of it here. And so, we've made it to the Citadel of Trials. This episode is going to be ten minutes, and I want to do this all in one episode instead of cutting it off in the middle. So this is a bit of an unorthodox filler episode, I guess. Um, so, I guess next time, we will be taking on the Citadel of Trials. And hopefully not meeting our inevitable doom. Yeah. We shall see. We shall definitely see. Um, if you like this video, please do subscribe. Uh, check out my other uh, playlist of Perfect Drop Mod and the... Uh, I'm getting too tired. It's 11 o'clock at night where I am right now. I'm usually sleeping by now. Uh, Final Fantasy 1 Knights Challenge and Diablo 2 Perfect Drop Mod. I do hope that you catch those. And please subscribe. To, go check out Dark Kefka, for he was my inspiration for all this. Uh, I hope to see you again sometime. See you around.